round here, the, this is um, an area of outstanding natural beauty and we've been building a Mesolithic hut which is based on a design that was used all over the United Kingdom about 10,000 years ago and we're trying to recreate it, trying to capture what it was like to be a Mesolithic person around this area at this time. And so at the end of the project I think uh, we're going to stay in it uh, as if we were hunter-gatherers, so it should be good. You have to build sticks almost like a teepee, then we get the bracken and layer it on. Today we've been gathering, gathering bracken, bracken and putting it on our hut and making it waterproof. We've whittled sticks to make spears and some arrows as well and we also went out and did some archery. You have to actually aim higher than you expect to get it Yeah, to hit it was the quite board. hard yeah. to hit it, because you, good you would have thought it would be easy, like you aim at a target and shoot, but it was quite hard and it was really easy to miss it. So it would have been really hard to live back then and try and shoot <laughs> your food. Um, Are we going to do some pottery? I don't yeah, know. we were going to do yeah. some pottery next week, Yeah. because um, they would have had to make their own bowls. We were looking for burdock roots. And we're going to cook them in the stew. Uh, we're going to cook supper and then eat supper and then talk all night. And we've learnt how to create fires and we've seen loads of wildlife actually. A red admiral butterfly, a speckled wood I think it was. And um, we saw lots of birds and like, but we heard some, was it buzzards? And seeing the toads and fog. So today we've been weaving together a Viking ship <laughs> for kids to play in. Um, it's good because the willow survives a long time and grows really fast, so this is why we're cutting it back really. So you have to weave uh, the pieces together and then uh, plant them in a formation, so row by row at angles, and then weave them in and out of each other in a crisscross pattern and that will Hopefully it's last a long time <laughs> and be quite strong and sturdy. Um, we're taking some of the pieces that have come off the boat and we're going to build another structure at the Novas. We've been building a shelter to watch deer out of and we've built it out of willow by weaving the willow together so that it'll grow back in the spring and then leaves will cover us so we can watch the deer. Um, it's fun, it's just hard to reach the top of it because sometimes not enough handheld and it hurts your fingers quite a bit. I think I've got this in there. It's quite fun, everyone gets to go at each different aspect of it as well. So you get to hold them from the bottom and then also do the climbing. You have to always rely on people to tell you where the next foot piece is or something if you get stuck and it's good to help each other out and it's been really fun to get up to the top and feel like you've achieved something.
a bit of fun and it's something different. It's much more fun than just sitting at home. I haven't brought my phone with me. You know, you don't miss it because you're busy. And, and it's really fun, you, like it's really good isn't yeah. it? Yeah. 